Hello and welcome along. Uh, today we're back on Felsbrunn and uh, we're heading down to the shop at the moment in our stire. Uh, and the reason for this is because we're gonna do uh, we're gonna try and kill two birds with one stone today. Uh, there's a mission on field 21, which I'm gonna go and accept in a moment. Um, in the meantime, uh, we have uh, we also need to spread some lime on our field. So the easiest way for us to uh, to basically cover both of those things is for us to go and buy a new piece of equipment. So we're going to go and buy ourselves a lime spreader. Uh, we're also going to buy ourselves a front loader attachment for this uh, because one of the things I want to do is I don't want to uh, for for things like lime and things. Uh, I don't want to be. Uh, I don't want to be loading stuff just by parking it next to it. Uh, I actually want to use the uh, the actual um, the actual forks. So we're going to put that on the stire as well. Uh, I haven't quite worked out what colour I want to do at the moment. We might do white or we might do black uh, front loader, but we'll see when we get down there. I think a black front loader might look quite nice on it. Possibly even a red one. Although the clamps themselves, the actual bits uh, themselves, are black. So uh, that might be the better way for us to go. Uh, but we're down at the shop now and we can make our decision. So let's head over to the actual uh, shop area over here. Uh, and we will buy our spreader. So it's under fertilizer technology here. Uh, and the one we're going to go for is the K105. Uh, it's 39,000. Uh, we will mitigate a little bit of that with the job we're about to do. Uh, but the job we're about to do will actually more likely cover uh, our costs of fertilizer and lime. So uh, let's go ahead and get this. Uh, what I'm going to do is I quite like the idea of these spreading discs. So that takes it from... 12 meters to 18 meters which means that we we cover a lot more ground uh it takes it from 39 to 47 uh but that's fine i i think we're going to be using this a lot for missions and things like that so that's why i'm going to grab this like this uh so that's a good purchase for us at the moment we should be able to mitigate that with uh stuff pretty quickly uh and then we need uh so for what we're going to do we're going to need a bag of uh solid fertilizer so we'll buy a bag of that actually considering buying two uh but for now we uh we might come back to the shop and buy another one and we need a lime bag for what we're going to do later so we'll buy that as well and there we go Right, so final thing we need is we need to get a front loader. Uh, so there's our front loader. Uh, we'll just get the FZ30. Uh, we don't need a particularly big one. Uh, we want to do it in, uh, I think we'll go with the black one. I think that will look really nice on the front of our style. Um, and then a set of forks. I'm actually going to go with, I think, a red set of forks. Uh, which one? Uh, then we'll go with the case IH red. Okay, so there we are. So there we are. So uh, we've actually parked in a pretty good place for our uh, thing. Uh, so spread all with our spreading disc. So that's 18 meters. That goes pretty wide. And uh, and yeah, and then uh, and then we've got a nice nice big setup. Right, so let's go and get our contract. So this is our contract that we want three thousand seven hundred and ninety-two. We're going to use our own equipment, so we will just accept the contract. Uh, there we go, and uh, and so we now just need to do field twenty-one. So we'll drop our front weight off of our tractor. So we don't need that initially. Just put that on the side over here. So lower that down. Enough. Right, and then we will get our front loader on. And what we can do actually is we could put weight on that. I think we're alright for the amount of uh, size this actually, or the amount of weight that will be on the front of these. There we go. So connect that up. Uh, 
that's interesting. Ah, ah there we go. I caught the button on the top of my uh, joystick on my side panel. Ah, and it wouldn't raise and lower. So there we go. Right, so let's go around here. Solid fertilizer big bag in. I'm hoping this job is not going to take more than a single big bag. It would be odd if it did, because uh, obviously we have a... Uh, it would take it would cost us a, a lot more than the actual jobs work that is the case. Which I have heard a couple of people say. There we go. We could have gone with a slight grey on this uh, this stole front loader. But I think this works. Right, so up we go and load our Weedle. Like so. Like the red. Uh, that will take the entirety of this big bag, definitely. There we go. Right, so I'm going to back off, and we're actually going to drop our front load off. We don't need it for now. I don't want to do this job with the front loader on. So uh, make sure we've got the right bit selected. And reverse. And get the other bit off. There we go. So we can come back and get those later. Uh, for now, we are just going to connect up. Uh, we're going to connect up our front weight again. Just so that we offset any weight that the uh, the actual spreader causes. There we go. And reverse up. And here we are. Set that up as well. And away we go. So field 21, looking at the map. Not sure I thought I had assigned it to my uh, wheel, but I haven't. So field 21 actually is pretty close. Uh, really close, in fact. It's just over this way here. Uh, you can see it. In fact, there we go. Uh, well, this is a way in. We can work our way back towards our farm. But not that that matters very much with this. Right. And so, we will un Fold. I'll spread it. Now, 18 meters, that's going to be wider than that. So we'll move over here a bit. There we go. Right. And uh, turn off our indicator. Activate our spreader. And yeah, look at the width on that. Wow. Okay, that is, that is pretty wide. We'll make very short work of this job. In doing so, is going to earn us uh, a little bit of money. Uh, you know, sort of 4000 back towards the cost of this spreader, uh, which is quite good. That's that's going to be a really nice amount heading back to us from the cost of the spreader. Uh, and the lime and the fertilizer, of course, as well. Uh, I'm very much wanting to buy another field. The, the field I really want to work on at the moment is uh, is field 19. Uh, I think it's field 19, sorry. Let's have a look. Uh, no, field 9, sorry. I keep calling it 19 and it's field 9. Uh, and that is because field 9 uh, has potatoes in it at the moment, I think. Wow, we are really motoring through this fertilizer. We're going to need another big bag, I think. Possibly. Because we are... No, we're actually, we're not doing too badly. I'm making sure that I've not got a huge overlap. Because that will cost us. But yeah, we've got 750 uh, litres left. Uh, to do the rest of this field. It is going down fairly quick at the moment. Do I still have a... I do, I still have my indicator on. Let's turn the indicator on. There we go. Alright, so another turn. Last turn. Six are oh, we easily have enough. So we'll actually be able to one of the things we'll be able to do with this is once we've finished, we'll be able to sell back any remaining fertilizer. Um which is uh which actually will have half a bag. So what I'm gonna do is I'm not gonna sell it back. Um this half a bag of fertilizer will easily do 
uh, our own stuff and we could even use it towards another mission if we wanted or another contract if we wanted so it's great for that and uh, and uh, yeah I think it'd be really useful for that so there we go so that is that done uh, 506 so we've got half of our bag left uh, that's fantastic that's really really good nice short quick mission uh, it's contract sorry so there we go contract is complete so we complete that and uh, and there we go so we're gonna head back down to the shop now we're gonna uh, empty out the remaining uh, fertilizer in here we'll transport that back later I need to get uh, probably a small trailer or something to transport stuff with um, but considering a big bale trailer or um, yeah we don't we don't really have a big bale trailer at the moment available to us there's only the small one uh, but what I'm going to do is going to come in here, turn around, and we will unload this. Let's all pin this here. Uh, reverse up to here, and we should be able to go and unload. Unload. No, that's unfold. Unload is I. All right. I need to. I need to sort that. Still have a few bits to do. Right, so that's unloaded that over there. Uh, what we need to do now is we need to put the lime on. Because if we have a look at our map. So we own field 17. You can see that we have harvested it. What it does need is it needs lime spread on it. So that is what we're going to be doing now. So we'll disconnect that. And come to here. Lower this down. There we go. And drop that off. Right. And then we're going to get our bag of lime here. So we're going to put our front loader on. Transport the lime back up to... Uh, or, yeah, take the lime-filled spreader back up the top. And then what we'll be able to do is we'll be able... To go from there and uh, we'll be able to unload the lime up there. And we could transport the uh, fertilizer back in the spreader. We're actually going to need the fertilizer in the spreader next. Uh, so it might be a case of unloading the lime coming back down here. And uh, doing that. Right, and in. There we go. Ooh. Yeah, you can see that really we should have the weight on the back. The line weighs more. That's interesting. So we weren't having that problem with the fertilizer. The line weighs more. We definitely need, really, to have this back weight on when we're doing the line. There we go. That has uh, given us a better, uh, uh, a better weight distribution, and will make it easier for us to uh, to do this. So let's lift that up. There we go. Absolutely fantastic. That is, is now just loading all that lime in there, and, uh, and we'll go, we're going to go and spread it on our field, and that should work really well. It's a pity there's no uh, lime spreading missions uh, we've got at the moment. We could use that. We're going to have uh, the rest of this lime. Is uh, oh, that one? Let's get the right tool. Drop off. This is this is all the manoeuvring and uh, and moving around the place. Right, there we go. 
Hook up the back of our thing, and then uh, and then we're going to spread our field. And so yeah, this this will be a quite successful little uh, a little set of stuff to do. It's uh, it moves us forward on our farm, on our uh, on building our farm, brings in a little bit of extra money. Basically, that mission has paid for, or that contract has paid for uh, our line and the uh, and the fertilizer for use on it. Uh, Stuff is stuff is beginning to grow again, which is pretty good. As I said, really want to get a mission on Field Nine. I think at some point what will happen is uh, when Field Nine grows enough, we will do the potato mission that hopefully will come from it. And once that's done, and we make some money from that, because that should be a fairly lucrative mission for us, or sorry, fairly lucrative contract for us. Uh, we should be in a position where we can then go and uh, just make a load of... Uh, well, we can go and buy it and we can look at establishing our farm. Right, so we know, actually, that this is wider than I've just set this. Yeah, there we go. That is our width for line spreading. How about that? So we'll keep on the lines here and we can we can actually see one of the nice things about line and uh, in cab is we can actually see how well our line spreading is going now looking at the line spreading wow how quickly is that going down so we know from this we are gonna have to get a lot more line because that's one row one row and we're out of line so how many have we got we've got we're gonna have to fill this with line so uh, i'm gonna head back down to the shop and we're gonna get this absolutely filled with line so i've worked out that uh yeah it will hold it will hold up to five of these big bags uh, of lime so uh, that is how many we're going to be putting in. And uh, yeah, so we're going to load this up with five of these. Uh, it's going to take me a minute, but I just wanted to show you this lineup. It should take, it should take four and a half to be exact. So we are going to be needing one here. Um, I'm hoping that's going to be enough to do fear. But we shall see very quickly, I think. Uh, but yeah, so I'm going to get this loaded up and then we'll head back up to the field and uh, and we'll get it spread with the line. So we're returning to our field now. We have a uh, completely full uh, spreader, as you can see. Uh, so we're going to get that coming out. And hopefully this is going to be enough to do this field. Uh, as I said, hopefully we really will be able to cover all of this. Um, it's, I can't believe that line doesn't go that far. Uh, and this is this is the smaller of the two spreaders. So yeah, it, it's possible that the uh, the bigger spreader would do us better, but uh, it's yeah, it's slightly concerning how quickly we're going to get through this line. So, uh, yeah, I need to make sure I preserve it as much as I can. As little wasted um, as possible. It takes about, it takes nearly 2,000 uh, litres per run, uh, is the crazy thing. So, uh, we need to, we need to really, really be getting uh, the most out of this that we can. And make sure that we're well. Hopefully, we're going to be halfway through with each run, but it's yeah, it's quite a big undertaking. This no real wastage available. Let's see how we're doing. We are 
Okay, see we're now halfway, we're coming up to halfway through the amount that we have. And uh, well, we're probably halfway through the field, but we did start with our with a row as well. So we've had more than uh, that. We are, we are over halfway through uh, the amount of lime we have available. It's going to take, it is going to take a little bit more lime than we have, I think. Which is uh, slightly annoying. Uh, that we need to go and fill up again, uh, but uh, you know this is this is the way it goes. This is this is the one of the joys of farm sim, uh, especially especially learning a new uh, thing on it is that it's you never you're never quite sure how it's going to go initially. There we go. Right. I'm getting getting an idea for the right width. Of spreading stuff, yeah. See, I'm still not quite sure of what my actual spreading width is. I'm not too worried about leaving a small gap. Um, what we have, though, is we definitely need. Well, we can make an estimate from here. So we have what must be uh, one at least three more runs. So that's at least six thousand more liters we need. Uh, to cover this. Now what I'm going to do is rather than start an, uh, a partial there, I'm just going to go back and cover this. These two sort of bigger patches that I've left. There we go. Right, so uh, let's fold this up uh, and head back to the shop. There we go. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to go and fill up with a little bit more. We'll come back and I'll finish off the field. So I'll see you once I've got refilled. So we're back at the field for what is hopefully the final time. Uh, we've added another um, three bags. So uh, we've added another 6,000 litres plus the uh, 1,000 litres we had left over last time and so the hope very much is at this point that, uh, that this will cover the remaining uh, amount of field that we need to do it does look like about uh, three maybe four more so we'll see how it goes but yeah yeah I'm trying to get it right up to the edge because this covers a uh, you know, not a huge amount. And even compared, actually, compared to the fertilizer, that's that's the odd thing. Compared to what we covered with fertilizer, this is uh, this is really not gone that so far. But uh, yeah, now I think I'm too close. Yeah, that should do it. Uh, it could easily be four. In which case, in which case, it would be more than two full loads of this uh, of this spreader to do this, uh, which is quite something. I'm really, really shocked at how much lime it takes to do a field of this size, because this field is not that big. Uh, part of the reason why we chose it as a starter field is because it's it actually covers quite a good. Uh, you know, it's 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 something that we could easily cover with this tractor and this combine. Uh, we're going to be all right. We're going to looking at this. This is this last strip is wider than I thought it was going to be, or is less wide than I thought it was going to be. Uh, and we've got enough. Yeah, we're going to have enough to cover this. That's great news. Uh, I'm really pleased that. Uh, that we're not going to leave the field with this big patch of uh, of uncovered stuff, and you can see here we should be able to cover this here. Again, it's still going down at an incredible rate. Now, can we? Will we have enough left over at the end of this run to do that little patch that I missed? 
I think we're going to. I think that this is going to cover this quite nicely. Oh, maybe not. Okay, we've got 25 litres left. Uh, I just want to try at the end over here. I came off a little bit early here. And it's just, we need the last 25 litres just to cover this little bit here. Oh, I didn't quite get it. Never mind. That is, uh, but that's done it. That's 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 done our field well enough. So we're going to need to uh, probably plough that in, I think, uh, next time. Right, let's turn our tractor off. Uh, and we need to go and pick up our front loader and our bits from the shop. Let's have a look. Uh, so let's keep, uh, well... Right, uh, so yeah, we've pretty well covered the lime. Uh, there's a few little bits, but that's good. Otherwise, if we take the lime off, actually doesn't need plowing. That's good news. No weeds, doesn't need plowing. We're actually good to uh, to just get a cultivator and cultivate that in. So we can do that next time, certainly. Uh, that will work nicely. Um, for now, though, uh, all that remains is for me to say thank you for watching. I hope you have enjoyed this video. Please give it a like, drop us a comment, and give it a share. And for all the latest videos and live streams from Virtual Farmer, please subscribe to the channel, and I will see you next time. Goodbye.